What's going on, world? It's your boy, Yavis, the Street Pastor. It's right here at Soul Food Sessions, exclusively for HolyCulture.net. Um, been away for a while, man. Been on the road, traveling a whole lot. I'm um, doing ministry. Um, God is truly opening up doors, and I thank Him for that. And this morning when I woke up, I said to myself, uh, I'm so tired of sleeping in hotel beds. Like, in the last, you know, 30 to 40 days, I've only slept in my own bed for maybe like three, three nights. And, um... I thought about my suitcase. I thought about the things that I had with me. If you look around my hotel room, or some things that you'll see, you'll see a, a king size bed. You'll, you'll see a TV, a microwave, a refrigerator. Um, you'll see a whole bunch of uh, fitted caps. I mean, you'll see that kind of stuff. And most of all, you'll see my suitcase. And the reason I need my suitcase is because I'm living out of it. You know, it's things in my suitcase that I need in order to survive on a day to day basis. Um, mostly because this hotel room is not my home. I don't live here. Any hotel I'm at is not my home. I do not live there. I'm temporarily there. And one thing God showed me is that a lot of times we um, try to hold on to things that he doesn't want us to have in the long run. You know what I mean? We try to hold on to this life. This, this life that we have right now is not for the long run. This life that we have right now is setting us up for something greater. See, understand that our citizenship is not to earth. Our citizenship is to heaven. Now, what happens when someone um, turns away from their natural born country or they fight against their citizenship or where they came from. It's called treason, right? And the punishment for treason is what? Death. See, if we are all supposed to be citizens from heaven from the start, since he knew us before we were in our mother's womb, um, that means that when we turn away from who God is, when we turn away from our lineage, when we turn away from our birthright, when we go against our citizenship, when we go against the things of heaven, we have then committed treason, right? We have then committed treason, which is what? Deserving of death. Sin is treason against God and deserving of death. But I thank God that he sent his only begotten son. He sent love down so that you and I could be forgiven for our treason. Philippians 3 and 20 um, really touched me this morning. It said, for our citizenship is in heaven, from which we also eagerly wait for the Savior, the Lord Jesus Christ. So what we learn is that everything is for his glory. Um, our official home is in heaven. And even now, because our citizenship is already registered in heaven, we're just waiting for the transfer. So it's very, very um, stupid or ignorant of me to think to myself that this is home. When really, it's just a hotel room. Somewhere for me to temporarily be staying. Don't treat earth as your home. Understand that you're just passing by, you're just visiting. The end goal is for us to meet Christ in glory, for us to see him in glory. So live each day as if you're striving to reach him in glory. Live out of your suitcase. Don't make a temporary place your home. With that being said, Soul Food Sessions, Slingshot the Movement, HolyCulture.net. God bless you. Every day I'ma get it, prison return with a vengeance And that's spreading this word I'm learning, no sermon, it's instant Got a penchant for change, came with no fear in his name And they cheer for the flame while I put his fear on the game